welcome to another episode of Let's Not Play. Today, I'm going to be playing a game called Castle. Never judge a book by its cover. Based on the TV show called Castle. Now, I guess I should note that I've never actually seen the show. I don't really know much about it. But, um... I've always, uh, I've, I've been a fan of, like, detective kind of games. Sherlock Holmes and, you know, things like that. Um, especially, you know, good de detective games, stuff like that. Um, but I don't know if this is going to be a good one or not. I haven't played this before, even though you see here it says, Welcome Sir Cappy. All I've done is set up the profile and change the sound options so that it's quiet enough. And, um, that's, uh, that's about it. That's about all I've done. So let's start. There's a man watching green porn, another man behind him. In the library, of course. That's it. One small little jab. Oh, we're off to a good start, ladies and gentlemen. This is, uh... Great, great cutscene here. Wow. They really put a lot of time and effort into this. Look at that animation. Those graphics. Oh, he's turning him into like a Frankenstein monster. Electric dog fence? I don't even know what's going on right now. Dad, can you help us with the guest list? Graham and I are planning a special dinner party. It's going to be fabulous! And since we'll be hosting it here in your loft, you should get some input as well! That's very thoughtful of you, Mother, but I can't help out. I'm struggling to meet a deadline on my new novel. So much so that it looks like I'm going to have to break out my old typewriter for good luck. Oh. Okay, I understand. But at least tell me if we should invite Kate. Of course Kate's coming! We wouldn't have it any other way! Now let's leave Richard to his work! Would you like some interactive help while you play? No. Uh, I don't really know what I'm doing though. Maybe I should have said yes. I found an important item. Letter opener. Uh-huh. Okay. The top shelf is too high to reach. Oh. Got an important item. Office key. Okay. Anything else to click on? I don't want to talk to them. Uh-huh. Alright. I guess I'll just take this key and open up the office door. Turn it. This is what I call a good game. Oh, oh, the Aurora Borealis is in my house. Oh, oh, it's a mess. It's an I Spy game. Everyone, I'm playing I Spy right now. I've got the blank paper. Oh, I was afraid it was going to be something like this. This is not what I call a good detective game. This is what I call lazy. A flamingo. But they have a nice little Macintosh computer. A fake Macintosh computer. Probably a Chinese knockoff. What else am I looking for here? Um, a pen. What am I supposed to do with this? Um... What am I looking for? A wristwatch. Got that one. Um, a writer vest. Writer vest. I didn't know those existed. I don't know what the point of that is. Musical note. I saw it. There it is. Come on, I clicked on it. Um, a ship. I'm hoping that something good will happen. Uh, at some point, like an actual game will start. Um, a flamingo. 
A flamingo, guys. Where, where is the flamingo? You guys have probably already spotted. There it is. You guys have probably already spotted most of these things, and are just getting mad at me for not seeing it. Scissors. Sharpened pencil. Oh, do I take this and sharpen it? Doesn't look like a pencil to me. It looks like a dart pen. There's a pencil sharpener. Okay, never mind. Um, oh, it's a dart. Bullseye. Found it. It's right, right there. Uh, a ship. It, that's not a ship. No, oh, there's a gavel. Found a gavel, guys. A moth. I'm pretty sure I saw a moth already. Don't know where it went, though. This is thrilling gameplay. That's a B. You guys are probably really thrilled right now watching me play this. Oh, there's a pencil. Sharpen it. Okay. What's a, what's a geode? It's going to be hard to find something when I don't even know what it is. Just click around and stuff. Need a ship and a moth, though. It's hard to be funny when this is the game that I'm playing. If you guys have seen the show, you know, is this what they do? Do they just go to a cluttered desk and start looking for things? Silhouettes. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, that, that helps a bit. This is the geode. Um... Uh, <laughs> um, moth. Oh, there's a ship. Now all I need is a moth. There's a feather duster. It's close. Oh, there it is. You guys have probably been screaming at the computer screen. It's on the desk! All that just for a blank piece of paper? Come on, that was the first thing I found. The vent is loose, but I can't pry it off with my bare hands. Use a letter opener. Oh, that actually is what you're supposed to do. I found a typewriter key. Is that what this is all about? Just me finding a typewriter? Really? Oh, I need a blank piece of paper. And put a stool over there. No? The ribbon is still missing. Um, um, okay. Oh, oh, not what I meant to do. Go back in there. The ribbon is still missing. I thought that I saw, oh, that was just for that. Um, all right, I'm just going to click around. Is there a ribbon in here? Have you guys seen the ribbon? Uh, I don't actually feel like ha having a conversation with them. Top shelf is too high. Oh! Uh, hey! Go over here. Found it! I don't think it's a very important item, but okay, if you say so. She should be in working order now. If this won't break the spell, I don't know what will. Castle, where have you been? I haven't seen you around the precinct. Don't ask. Let's just say I'm struggling with some domestic issues. Well, I think I've got something to take your mind off of your troubles. We've got a new case and it's right up your alley. The press beat us to the scene and have already dubbed him the hardcover killer. Meet us at the Mako Energy Power Plant as soon as you can. You won't be disappointed. Okay. I played a game similar to this on my iPod. And you know, for an iPod game, it was fine. For an actual PC game, I'd expect something better than just iSpy. 
Oh, our killer staged the murder to look like a scene from Frankenstein. Oh, I was right! Hey, look at that, I was right. All that's missing is the green monster makeup. The victim's even holding a hardcover copy of the book. Actually, Mary Shelley's monster was created from human parts and would therefore have been flesh toned. The green skin was Hollywood's contribution to this literary classic. It was actually gray skinned because it was a black and white movie. Thank you for the fascinating literature lesson, Castle. If you guys are down with your book club meeting, maybe we can start the investigation now. I won't be able to examine him while there's a charge run through his body. I tried using the control panel to turn the generator. Some of the fuses appear to be missing. Yeah, they're labeled electric dog fence. I don't know if it's an electric fence for a dog or if there's an electric dog that's in a fence. Or surrounded by a fence. Castle and I will look for a way to turn off the generator. You just keep an eye on our victim. Yeah, make sure he doesn't get away. Electric dog fence. There's screws holding the fuse into place. Ah, I guess I'll have to go back home and get my tool supplies. Or something. Have you tried turning off the power? The control panel is generally knows is missing two fuses. They're over here! These ones! No? No, no one checked to see if they were over there? Let's go in here. See if there's a screwdriver anywhere. Always oh, too dark to see anything. Guess I'll go back. The door is locked. Of course it is. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, murder board. I don't have any evidence, witnesses, suspect, or even a victim, apparently. Mm -hmm. Let's have a chat with the victim. K go away. There's gotta be something in here. It's too dark to see anything. I'm scared. I can see things just fine. Uh huh. Okay. Seriously, I need to find a screwdriver somewhere. Oh, what's this? Yeah, cause you can do that. That wouldn't be hot or anything to touch. Perfect. I have found a wallet. This wallet appears to belong to our victim. The driver's license inside says his name is Samuel Myers. Maybe that's the name of uh, the murderer. You knew him? Yeah, he's a book critic down at the Daily Journal. He always, gives my, he always gave my novels great reviews. You can see he was kind of a fan. I've heard of him before. If I remember correctly, he has the tendency to give writers harsh reviews if he doesn't care for their work. Could have made a few enemies that way. It looks like we have an idea on our victim, Ryan and Esposito. Joe Esposito? You're the best around. Okay. Nothing's ever gonna keep you down. That's me and my beautiful singing. Ah, excellent. I found a card in this conveniently opened locker. I don't have a I don't- I can't just guess exactly, so let me go. I don't really feel like I'm doing much. Hey, I opened a door. That's gameplay, right? Ah, oh, another I spy. Oh, let's take a look over here first. This hinge is rusted shut. I don't have an employee ID. Oh, I'm supposed to look at the murder board. It's been flashing at me. Uh, used to ID the victim to discover his home address. Found dead, discovered by morning shift employees. Crime scene and body altered to mimic Frankenstein. Yep. And here we go. Looking for an eight ball. Oh, I guess I should look at the item list. Um. Okay, what am I looking for? I'm looking for an eight ball. There's an eight ball. Camcorder. Oh, that's something that I'm supposed to interact with. 
Oh, it's part of laser tag gear. What is this? What am I holding? A pan flute. Pan flute. I'm looking for more than just that one. There's another one. And there's one more piece of the pan flute. Right there. Found it. Alright, let's see here. Is a cassette tape? Perfect. Um, electric screwdriver. Well, that's going to be handy. There's a walkie-talkie. Uh, a number 13. Nope. Nope. Um, ah, perfect. Uh huh. Uh huh. Measuring tape. Nope. Army man found him. Uh, coffee mug. Not that one. To go coffee mug. Uh, fan. Nope. Apparently that's not a fan. Uh, I I don't know. I need a golf club. How about that? Is there a golf club? That's not one. No, there's a camcorder. Awesome. Golf club, fan, and baseball. Those are the things that I have left. There's a turtle staring at me. Menacingly. Um. Okay, really? What are the silhouettes? Okay. Trying to match the silhouettes here. Um. Oh, there's a golf club. Where is the baseball? It's, it has to do with something that I have to interact with. But, um... What else is there to interact with? I don't see the hand appearing anywhere. Or the, um, the gear symbol. Oh, 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 oh! There you are. And a fan. Okay, seriously? Come on, where where is this fan? You guys are screaming at the computer screen. It's right there! It's right in front of you! How can you not see it? But I seriously, I can't see it. <laughs> oh, no, that's not it. Just bear with me, guys. I'll find it. I swear I will find it. There. There it is. I found it. I found the screwdriver. I knew that was going to be the important item. I just have to play through the rest of the stupid game. Maybe I don't. Maybe if I know that's the item that I need, that's, that'll be it. Let's uh, look here. Use the electric screwdriver. Okay. Fuse one of two. Well, what do you mean one of two? The other one's here too, isn't it? Really? I can't pick it up? Oh, I found an oil can. Oh. Clever. No, it's not clever at all. It just happens to still have oil in it. Found the other one. Okay. Am I still playing? No, this is chapter one. I was about to ask if I was still playing the prologue. Nodes active. What, what am I supposed to do here? What is this? Okay. Hmm. Yep. Yep, this is happening. 
Oh, guys, bear with me. I've never been good at this game. I did it. No, I didn't. I didn't do it. I just skipped. Because I couldn't do it and I was getting bored. Now that we won't get electrocuted by our victim here, let's see what we can find out about him. There was none among the myriads of men that existed who would pity or assist me. And should I feel kindness towards my enemies? No. From that moment I declared everlasting war against the species and, more than all, against him who had formed me and sent me forth to this insupportable misery. Looks like the victim was murdered before being hooked up to the generator. I'll get him down to the lab and call you when I have a full diagnosis. I'm checking the murder board first. Not be a Frankenstein novel, a specific text within the book is highlighted. Text refers to getting revenge on one's enemies. You guys might want to hurry on over to Meyer's apartment. Why? What's going on? Looks like someone broke in. No signs of a struggle or evidence though. The plot thickens. This case just keeps getting better. You have a weird sense of humor, buddy. Map. Alright, what have we got? Whoever broke into Meyer's apartment left it a complete mess. And you'll have to search through items in an I Spy like game to find one specific item. And you'll be bored out of your mind by playing this game. But from what we've seen, nothing has been taken. That's odd. So whoever did this just broke in and destroyed the apartment? You might want to talk to Mrs. Goodman, Meyer's neighbor. She's kind of staring at you. You can see her in the doorway. She's, she's kind of just staring into your soul. She says she saw the guy. Hi, Mrs. Goodman. I'm Detective Beckett and this is my partner, Castle. I'd like to talk to you about what happened next door. I heard loud noises coming from next door. I came out to see what all the commotion was about and saw a man in Mr. Myers' apartment. He was throwing things around and seemed very angry. Did you get a good look at the man's face? Did he look familiar? No! Once I saw it wasn't Samuel, I went back into my apartment and called the police. I figured it may have been the man from yesterday. Man from yesterday? Yesterday! I heard yelling coming from next door. It sounded like Samuel and another gentleman were having a bit of a disagreement. Did you happen to hear anything they were talking about? No! I'm sorry, dear. At this age, I'm lucky I can hear anything at all. Well, Mrs. Goodman, at least you have an optimistic view on life. She did it! Arrest her! That is all. Do we have a search warrant? It's blue. Does that mean I'm playing a different I Spy game? Nope, the same one. Ah, uh, this will be the last, uh, last place that I look through. And I'm going to call it quits. If you guys actually want to see more of this or whatever, uh, you know, let me know in the comments below and I'll play through the rest of the game just for you guys. Just for you guys. Uh, fork keyboard handcuffs not quite sure why he has handcuffs in his apartment uh, slipper gold coins musical note I'm not quite sure oh well there's a big a piggy bank? A piggy bank? 
Uh, take the hammer and smash it. Take the gold coins. Mine! All mine! <laughs> Baseball. When I do weird things like that, just pretend that I don't. I think we'll all be happier if you just pretend that I, uh... It's apparently not a mirror. If you pretend that I don't do things like that. Uh, slipper. Just one slipper. Is there another hand symbol anywhere so I can just get the stupid musical note out of the way? Oh, well, there's something to do here. Mm-hmm. Oh. Just scrub, scrub, scrub. Musical note. Uh, a microscope right there. A candle. Where? Where? I, uh, I don't, I don't know where. Let's take a look at the silhouette so I know what I'm looking for. So that's what the candle looks like. There it is! <laughs> it's right in front of me! Of course they couldn't see it, it was right in front of me! Come on, that's, that looks like this. Oh, it's right there. And... Uh... Whatever those are, right there. Shackles. Shackle, shackle. Is it shackle? A dead remote. That's a universal remote? Looks like a tablet. Several keys missing. What's your top of the line? Not too shabby. Ms. Myers, not too shabby. How does it open? We have any invisible handles. It's signed that we're supposed to be stylish and chic. There should be a remote around here. So I'm welcome. I'm impressed. When you become such a technology connoisseur. A connoisseur. I don't. When I started reading the electronics magazine, that was misplaced in our mailbox. Instead of writing my newest book. The remote is dead. I'll need to replace the batteries before I can use it. Always oh, some. This is a remote. Oh my god. Okay. Well, there's something here apparently. The stainless steel box attached to the bottom of this couch. Okay. How am I supposed to get it? Well, there's a lock on here. I wouldn't put my hand in that fish if I was you. And why is that castle? This is a terrorist. I just know everything about everything. Don't you know that? It's venomous. Just trust me on things. Life would be so much better if you just trusted me on everything. It looks like I'm supposed to reattach them. There's a... I should look for a way to turn the fan off. Yes, yes you should. That would be wise. Open. Oh, power cord is damaged. And there's no way to open it without a power supply. Ah, tweezers. And a Q-tip. Or a cotton swab or something. Alright, uh, cotton swab. Nope. Okay. I don't know what the tweezers are supposed to be for. Clearly not to put things back together. To get the key out. No. Nope. Is that all that was in there? I can't actually go into the bathroom? Uh, drawer is locked. Of course it is. Am I supposed to use the tweezers to pick the lock? I know that there are keys missing, but can't you just pick up some keys? No? Alright, well... Even though I didn't actually finish this room or whatever, I'm gonna call it quits now because it's been... a long time. So I'm calling it quits now. If you want to see the rest of this or whatever, just let me know. In the comments below, whatever. Send me a message, say, hey! I want to see more of you playing Castle, because that was fun. Something along those lines, and if 
I get enough requests or whatever, I will play through the rest of this game. Because why the hell not? All right. If you liked the video, you know, comment, subscribe, like the video, click on like, share it, whatever. Uh, thanks for watching. And um, see you next time. Bye.